Hi right, guys. It is a gray, gloomy, probably soon to be rainy day here in the end times. But at least it's 72 degrees and uh after that shit for our four day summer we had, I will take it. Give me the 72 and the and the gray gloom over that fucking burning hot sunshine in 92. Jesus. Uh, anyway, but it is a now a Saturday afternoon, December 9th, 2023, and uh, I have to head into Ithaca, New York, to the Walmart to buy my dog's chicken. You know, Sancho Panza eats Walmart chicken and brown rice. I can't believe he's already gone through that last chicken. So. That's what I'm doing, uh, waiting for the next onslaught of vacation revelers to come through here on a rainy night. I don't know exactly what these people are going to do. and uh, So, I go on and, you know, I'm, I'm getting slammed from all sides. I've got taxes, insurance, vehicle repairs blah the fuck blah I am probably uh, if I'm lucky probably gonna spend like five thousand dollars I'm guessing uh, over the next few weeks with all of this uh, various shit going on so I've got to get some money out of goddamn PayPal you know where uh, the vacation rental places just you know, they just pay me by putting money in my PayPal account. So, all summer long, uh, this money has just been accruing in PayPal. So, I, I go to get into my own fucking PayPal account to get my own fucking money out of it to send to my own fucking bank. This is the challenge, and... You know, I, I've had this goddamn account uh, for how many years where I guess the last time was June. Last time was June. Go into my fucking PayPal account and it says, you know, send money to, to your bank. And, and you hit fucking send money to your bank. And I've tried this three times today and I fucking, uh, and, I'll, and I'll hit transfer my own fucking money out of my own fucking account to my own fucking bank account and it and it comes up with this weird fucking shit telling me why I cannot transfer my own money and I've got to set up some fucking kind of new new account that PayPal has created some fucking extra layer of bureaucracy where you, where you got to go on to this and, and, and get involved with this whole other layer. Uh, you're talking about uh, fixing what's not broken. So I get all of this fucking bullshit and I uh, say, fuck this shit, so I call this uh, dear sweet friend of mine and asked her, I, I said, darling, uh, could, could you just deal with this shit for me? Uh, I don't know what the fuck is going on and uh, <clears throat> I need to get some fucking money in the bank. Uh, and she has no internet. No internet. I guess is this day three. Day three, just no explanation. Just the the the, the, the fucking. Uh, I don't know if it's just her Wi-Fi in her own house, or it's the whole, uh, or it's the whole neighborhood. I don't know what it is, but anyway. Uh, so. Whatever, her internet is completely down, and I can't get my fucking, so she can't do anything. 
Uh, I don't even know how she can talk on a cell phone. I mean, when my, when my internet goes down, uh, I have no way to, I lose my cell phone. I, I lose, both of my telephones are connected to my internet. So I would have had no internet for uh, three days. I would no longer be a super host on, uh, on any of my vacation rental places. I would have lost all of my super host and star host status. Would have lost about $500 worth of fucking business. Uh, you know, welcome to the goddamn future, people. Uh, Jesus fucking Christ is trying to do anything. I mean, what the fuck is going to happen when I get to goddamn Walmart to try to buy a fucking chicken for my dog? Oh, uh, Jesus. And, uh, so, you know, so, so guys, so I bought this, uh, trailer a, a, a few days ago, and I'm thinking about, uh, you know, it's a 27-year-old trailer that has just been sitting out in this guy's yard for at least three years, and uh, so I'm changing the tires on it, and I'm getting the, you know, the bearings uh, packed with grease, and I want to get a uh, tailgate. The thing has no tailgate on it, so I want to uh, get a tailgate ramp thing welded on the back, and, and I'm thinking, motherfucker, uh, I, I'm going to have to take this goddamn thing to the tire shop, probably to some wheel shop, and, and uh, then go find some goddamn welder, leave the fucking thing uh, for three weeks, so I... I start out yesterday with that goddamn trailer heading to the tire shop to get my to deal with the tires on it uh, before I get a flat tire on these uh, on these goddamn dry rotted tires that have just been s sitting out there for years and I'm thinking fuck this there's this Amish kid up there uh, this 18 year old uh, Amish kid uh, so I go up there through the farm and uh, talk to the kid and, and I said, uh, can you do all of this tire shit and these bearings and weld a gate on and, and all of this stuff? And he, and he goes, no problem, am I? Just leave it here and give me a few days on it. So... Uh, <laughs> You know, this goddamn kid, he's, he's 18, and an 18-year-old Amish kid uh, doing all of this shit that I, that I have no fucking clue how to do any of that stuff. Uh, anyway, so uh, my brand new trailer is sitting at an Amish farm getting worked on while the rest of the fucking planet collapses. Uh, you know, this, this kid, he, he has no internet connection. Uh, now, he does have a cell phone. This kid does have a cell phone, but he has, he has no internet. He sure as shit does not have a PayPal account. Oh, fuck. Just a small, a small taste of what we're getting ready to be dealing with. Get out there and enjoy your fucking internet and your PayPal and all your other fruits of global industrial civilization while you still can before this whole motherfucker comes crashing down and, uh, uh, another day on the planet. Bye, guys.